And last review of the week is going to be Miriam Login. Um, it is 41 chapters as of this recording. It is free. There is no English publisher for this. And it's a webcomic. So here's the webcomic description. Large numbers of monsters come out of the gate, which is the boundary of the world. After many sacrifices, people won the fight against the monsters through their awakening. Jin, I'm going to say the same one. Jim, Jin Taeyong is alive as an F-class hunter, which is the lowest level. After Jin has a hard time, he gets an old capsule. Then he goes into the capsule that is another martial hero's world. And the game system gives him special abilities. He starts growing up to become the best martial hero. Um, and that novel description really doesn't tell you much besides the, like, the first chapter or two of this like 41 chapter story. And again, it is ongoing. Um, it's still being translated now and, and published. Um, fan translated. Um, this is a good webcomic if you're in the mood for something that takes place in the martial arts path. I'm not sure what... Um, what original language this is in if it's korean or japanese i think it's i want to say korean um but don't quote me please um but it, it's set in that nation's history so you're going to see a lot of um actually i think that i've yeah i have i i have um sort of screenshotted some of the some of the context here and you can see that f that the actual art style is very reminiscent of, of kind of martial arts movies sent in like a historical past with people in robes um martial art battles, um, sword styles, spear styles. Um, and it's, it's, it's set in that setting. So if you like that kind of setting, then you're probably going to enjoy the story in particular. Um, because most of it takes place in that, in that past where the main character is playing this, this game, um, set in this like ancient history kind of past. Um, the real world section where the main character is an F class hero and the world in the modern world has like these gates going, that's a very small part of it. It, it comes back in the most, most recent chapters that have been, you know, scanned and, and translated. And like, I'm saying like there are 41 chapters currently, I think the modern setting comes back in like chapter 39 or something. So for the most of the story is set in the back in that past history. And the story itself is actually pretty entertaining. If the main character goes into this game world, and he's transporting to this body of this reprobate, um, reprobate noble who's a drunkard, and he spends the clan money on on hookers and stuff, and hookers and drinking, um, and he's considered a big loser in in his story world. Um, but the main character takes that character that body over. He kind of has some of the memories, but he doesn't really. So he's strutting over as a level one character, and he has to, and he's forced by the game system to improve not only the reputation of that character, but also the martial arts style. So he has to relearn them all, and he gets in a bunch of like quests and situations that keep getting more complex and more like clan related, with like fighting until like there's a big war and there's lots of fighting, good action scenes, um, but it's entertaining and it's humorous and there's there's action and stuff. So if you're into something, want to. It, it feel like something that has good element, but also I think the biggest charge is that it is set in, in, in the past world. Um, I think this is good for you. And as I've shown with the um, screenshots for the, for, the, for the comic, the art is really nice. Good color panels, good expressions, it can be emotions and humor and action, good backgrounds. And because of the historical period, there's uh, an accurate architecture and clothing to match the period, which is like a nice plus. That takes some, some research, in my opinion. Uh, so it, it does feel very authentic. Um, overall, a good entertaining read. Again, if you're in, in the mood for some little RPG web comic with like historical settings, the game mechanics are all there, but, um, and you see regular notifications, so that all exists, but, um, still entertaining score for me is going to be 7.5 out of 10. Um, Miriam Logan, this one was actually recommended by, um, a friend of mine, Charles Dean. So, um, I'd read part of it before, had to give a second chance and I enjoyed it. So get the score of 7.5 out of 10.